There's just something, something about sauce and meat and the carbs. up everybody it is a nice beautiful beautiful day here in cathedral city this is my hometown and you know what there's some pretty good places over here and a lot of people just don't check it out because they like to go to palm springs they like to go to coachella well let me tell you man cathedral city's got some spots too all right i showed you one spot cafetis it's all the way over there and just a few minutes out there's a place called la tablita Let's go get some really good Mexican food. All right, let's go. Guys, if you're ever in the area for the casino, for the Mary Pickford Theater, or you're buying a car at one of the dealerships, you gotta come over here to La Tablita. Now this place has great atmosphere, has this beautiful deck that they just built for the pandemic. Their lunch specials are really good. Their portion sizes are really good. Y'all, you really need to come try this out. And you know what? I'm just going to show you this starter of these chips and salsa. Man, their salsa is so good, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Dude, I'm going to get hammered. Did you say Michelob? What's the Swiss right there? Michelob. Michelob, bro. Michelob. Michelob. Check out this salsa, bro. And you know how I have to do it. I gotta do it. I gotta get an horchata because it was 80 degrees outside really hot but then I also had to do this starter right here I had to get a shrimp cocktail and believe it or not guys this is the small yeah it gets bigger than this I'm so excited for this shit look at that look at the size that's huge it's hot, dude. I'm so happy I'm excited for you I wish you liked shrimp. Missing out. Mm. One day maybe. Probably not. Mm. Especially because it's like 80 degrees right now. Is that it's so, ref so refreshing. Mm. Is that cold? Mm-hmm. That's why I really wanted it, because it's cold too. I've never really thought about that. So Anthony, explain to me what you got there. Um, one of these is a uh, enchilada, one of these is a tamale. I think this is a tamale. It's a freaking tamale right there. I got my burrito, some rice, some beans. You know what's funny is that they said it was a small burrito. Put your hand next to that shit. Bam. That is kind of small, bro. Kind of small. But then look at this. Damn. Guys, this is, uh, oh my God. This is why I came here. I woke up this morning thinking I need, no. I woke up yesterday morning thinking that I really wanted an enchilada. And then halfway through work last night, I was like, I want an enchilada burrito. And that's what I'm here for. Look at this delicious, oh my God. Mm. 
Did you know there's people who don't like flour tortilla? Like they just straight up just don't like it? Flour tortilla? Yeah. It's a little strange. But me? You get flour tortilla with some beans and some sauce? Mm. There's just something Something about sauce and meat and the carbs. <laughs> Cause he's like, why is um why is rice beef and sauce so good together? You know like a gravy oh, yeah, or like a salsa? It's just a perfect combo. Mm-hmm. I decided to get, I really like the beef one, but I decided to get chicken because I wanted to be a little bit healthier. But the beef one, damn, beef one's so good. It's a little thing like that though, that makes a huge difference. Mm -hmm. it's like, I'm, I'm starting to notice how food affects me though. Mm -hmm. Wonder what he's doing. You know what I mean? Ooh. Just left the restaurant. Guys, let me tell you, that was delicious. I am full. I can't eat no more. Oh my God. This is gonna be a really short video because I was just eating and eating. And let me tell you guys, wow. You're gonna come here, bring an empty stomach. Anthony, what did you think? 12 out of 10. Salsa was amazing. Tacos, chiladas. Look what you even got there. Oh. Fuck, I got leftovers because I got another meal because oh, shit was so good. You know how it is. I just burped on camera. I'm sorry, guys. I'm full. I'm full. I'm sorry. You know, that's real. Real stuff. Guys. Oh, I don't even know what to say. I'm so oh, shit. This guy with the flamethrower. What's he doing with the flamethrower, guys? If you know what he's doing, just uh, put it in the comments, let me know. All right guys, that'll be it for me today. You already know what to do. You gotta just like the video, subscribe, comment down below, hit that notification bell, follow us on Instagram. What else? All that, all that stuff, man. It helps me out with the channel. I wanna grow this thing. I want bigger numbers. I wanna go to a lot of other places too. This year, things are opening up again. I'm vaccinated. I want to go travel to other places. So if you have any ideas of where I should go, let me know. Because I am planning to travel real soon during the summer. And so hopefully you'll see next fight in another city. Maybe even another state. Okay guys, that'll be it for me today. I gotta go sit down. Gotta go, you know, take care of a like nap or something. I'm really full. All right guys, check out what we're having next week for our next bite. Peace. Bye.